for right now. Aditha up next. Let's go, Aditya. <laughs> Wow. Wow. So hard. All right. First thing I started out with are these drums. So they were like... Honestly, the main important thing is this kick. This thing is like the most important. So, like you see how like it, it like you take like the end of the kick and like you replace this here. That's that's literally like the most important thing. It, and it works so well with the bass too. And then honestly, all these other sounds, uh, offset your offset your claps, snares, whatever. Um, use a couple shaker loops. Bills. These are all from various kits, Monty Booker kit, Amo kit. Just separate this so it works well with the, the kick. Deep pocket in there. Um, and then this bell kind of like carries like the, you know. Okay, so that bell kind of carries everything. Um, for this part, I used a count loop, just for tradition. This like symbol, and then this like little riser thing. So it's just a pluck, and yeah, literally just that. Um. And I would say that's probably the drums. The only advice, like, I, or only, like, thing I would take away is this little kick thing. Like, that's, like, the most valuable, like, hack, I would say, that helps. Um, so I started out with, um, another sample. So this is the original. Yep, so that's a sample and I pitch it up and just chop it like with the with the beat. This fits the majority of the sample. I didn't change too much. I just paused it. Yep, and then put the bass. Just follow the same. stuff for the bass guitar and another thing is with the actual sample I put the little like dog uh bark autotune thing and then put it in the sampler stretched it bounced that then pitch this so it sounds like this just goes with the same thing And then obviously when you or actually when you have the um kick in the groove, make sure like it works. Like you see like if you notice this, if you notice this, like it, it should just work. It should complement it, but it should not hit all the time. So um if I just solo the bass and the stuff. Yeah, so then with everything together. Yeah, so that's the that's the that's the first part done, but the second part, 
um, relatively the same. Drums are the same. Um, a lot of unused portions, but I just play these chords. And I played this like minor ninth, just um, cause I played that on the normal Kenny battle that I won and just for like good luck. Like also did this here, so I layered it. These are all the things I use to so EP and tune. All right, got some, got some hot chocolate, but okay. So um, this is, this is all stock. Um, because I recently switched to Ableton, so I'm still not, I don't have my own sounds that much. And I, um, I chopped up this. But this is with the, the Ableton thing. If you put, like, beats, you put preserve, and you can do, like, transients or whatever. Like, you can put whatever setting you want here. And this is the amount you do with it. Why is that not working? Hold up. Yeah, there you go. So, yeah, and that with the thing, so. Oh, and the bass guitar as well, so. Just a bit of variation. Mostly complements the kick. It's just runs for a good, a good eight bars. And then I played this solo here, uh, put the sample again, layered it with the labs, like soft piano. So just just play a quick solo. I omitted some of it. I actually have a little bit of it here, but it didn't really sound good. Okay. Okay, so um other uses other usages of the sample um so I have this little like delay transition thing. This kind of like uh was inspired by like Kwame a bit. Um and how he did like his little like um it was like some shaggy sample or something, I don't know. And another thing I did was just this um Yeah, I mean that's how I made it, but um super glad. I was able to um, be in the semis and also really glad that um, I was able to compete against like people that I look up to and stuff. That's like really cool to be able to be a part of that. Um, I'm not really like experienced with um, beat battles. Uh, I think this is the seventh or eighth time I'm doing this, uh, doing a Kenny battle. So. Um, still have a ways to go in regards to like how like the creative process is but I'm pretty happy with what I have right now um yeah it's cool to see um people take their beat and yeah